Howdy doody everyone, this is Argon Matrix welcoming you to episode 42 of Super Mario RPG. So last time we started on this big climbing section in the sky, and we found this rare scarf, which is a strange and rare object indeed. Now, um, I recommend that you actually equip this to Peach as an accessory, or Toadstool, but for now I'm going to keep the bathtub ring on her because the mystery egg still hasn't hatched yet and I need that to happen before I can equip another accessory on her. So I'm just going to leave that like that for now, and we're just going to go ahead and move on here. Um, what's this? This is another area, there's a flower, and another flower, that's cool. And, whoa, cool. Um, who are those guys? I don't know. Let's just, I'm going to go ahead and move out a little bit here first. Uh, where is this? Oh my goodness, this is like a puzzle. Wait, what the hell? I didn't mean to come here yet. Okay. Alright, everyone, listen up! Wait, who's talking? Oh my god. Shut up! Uh, she doesn't look happy. King Nimbus's condition is growing worse. It This means we'll be losing our magnificent ruler. Hmm. These people all look really kind of familiar. But! It just so happens that I have found the prin missing Prince Mallow. Uh, the missing Prince, Prince Mallow. Wait, what? Prince Mallow? Holy crap. Prince Mallow, please, P sir, Prince. Hmm. Get over here! Does he bear any resemblance to our Mallow? The rest of these guys kind of do. Well, well. It seems that a little prince has a, li has a mild case of stage fright. Excuse me. Ha ha ha. What the hell? Oh my goodness. Come on, make it snappy. What? You can't get through. Well, just look at you, tubby. Oh, well, that's not nice. Whoa. Um. I don't get... Huh? How can that guy be the prince when he looks nothing like anyone else here? This is weird. He filled out a bit. He, he certainly must have. That's crazy. Looking fit. Fighting fit. I would not want to fight that guy. That, that guy looks scary. Hmm. Um. What? You're asking me to... Gracious, you're serious, aren't you? Why, I don't know what to say. Dear me. Hmm. I made my decision. At the request of Prince, I have agreed to become I was queen. What? Who won't use their queen? I haven't even... <laughs> it just makes me shiver. I haven't even known her very long, and I can already tell that I wouldn't want her as my queen. Alright, back to business. Hmm. Oh my goodness, this is not a good thing. This is like an evil dictatorship of this place. Can you believe it? What a coincidence. There's a prince with the same name as me. Oh, what a coincidence. I wonder what that could possibly mean. Don't we have anything better to do than hang around here? Come on, let's go find the rest of the star pieces. What? But Mallow, these like look these people look like you. Wouldn't you wanna Ugh, aren't you curious to even think that Oh never mind. Right, I'm just going to go back to this Bean Valley area, just so I can grab some of these, uh, well, I don't need the coins, but I know there's, like, frog coins and stuff that I missed around here, so we're going to go ahead and check that out. Alright, so head all the way down here. Whoa, whoa, damn it. Okay, well, that was really, what the hell? Um, okay, then. Well, I think I'm just... This is, yeah, I've, I've already been to this area before, so I might as well just start checking it out now. Oh, come on, I could have made that. There we go. Because there's a frog coin over there. Damn it. Damn it. Stop falling. Alright. Okay. So this frog coin should be pretty easy to get. Uh, if I just avoid that guy safely. Okay, um, oh my goodness, I can't even tell where that frog coin is. Okay. Now I can see its shadow, which is... Good, so now I can actually tell somewhat more where it is. Oh my god. You know what, I'm just gonna cut until I actually get it. Thank you! Oh my goodness, that was... That took forever. I don't even know how long that took. Because I stopped my timer, but... Oh, you don't even... I don't even want to know. Alright, so... I think that's all the frog coins. Isn't it? I certainly hope so. Because all the rest of this is just coins. Coins, coins, and coins galore, but my wallet's full. Grr! So I don't even care. I don't know where this other spring goes, but I'm just going to take the safe route here. Alright, so this is, I guess I can say, Nimbus Land. 
Oh, I'm looking for something to look in my eyes. That's interesting. Alright, so what have we got here? We have some uh, normal stuff, and we got some new weapons. We got the Mega Glove, the War Fan, the Hand Cannon, the Sticky Glove, and then we've got a bunch of fuzzy stuff. <laughs> fuzzy stuff. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and just check to see if I need to upgrade anything here, and I'll be back in a moment. Okay, guys, I'm back, and um, I've made up my mind here, so I know what I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna buy the Mega Glove, the War Fan, the Hand Cannon, and the Sticky Glove, because they're all better. And these fuzzy things, um, you can keep the work pants if you want, but I think personally that it's time to retire them. We've had them on for way too long. They're probably all stinky and nasty now. So I'm going to go ahead and buy all this fuzzy stuff. Mm, fuzzy. And we're going to go ahead and equip that all now, I suppose. So Mario, you get the Mega Glove. And uh, you also get the fuzzy shirt. So as you can see, it lowers... Um, Wait, how much does, does it lower his attack? Let's see. He's got 93 magic attack and 169 attack. Uh, so it lowers by 10, which is not too welcome, but... Oh, I don't know. It raises his defense pretty well, so I think it's a fair, fair trade-off. Personally, uh, you can stick with jump shoes for now. Uh, you get the war fan and the fuzzy dress, which is better in all respects than a nautica dress. Uh, hand cannon. And you get the fuzzy pants. Yeah, pretty much, like, if you want that little extra boost to attack, then keep the work pants, but personally, I think we're already strong enough without that little boost. We'll decrease in power a little bit, but I think... Since we're going to be bulkier now, it's going to be, I don't know, easier to survive, I guess you could say. Alright, fuzzy pants now. And, um, Bowser, I don't think we even got anything for you, did we? Nope. No weapons or anything. Alright, let's start selling some of this stuff now. Uh, the masher, we don't need that. Don't need this. 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 I'll keep all this. I'll keep the rare scarf. Definitely. Um, I think that's pretty much all I need to sell. So, uh, hopefully I didn't just make a complete mistake, because that would be lame as hell. Um, if you guys think, if you guys know, like, whether the work pants would, would be better statistically than the fuzzy pants, then feel free to let me know in the comments, but for now I'm just going to stick with, with it like that. Okay. Let's see here. Um... Okay, there actually is a hidden chest inside this shop. And it was in this area that I was jumping around. I don't know how I didn't hit it. But, alright, maybe it's here? Here, here, here? Um, let me see. Hmm. I don't know. This is very odd. There it is. Okay. Yeah, so just you just have to pretty much jump towards the shopkeeper from the top there. And you'll get that frog coin. Alright, what do you say? I used to work for King Nimbus, but all of a sudden one day, Valentine told me I was fired. I just don't get it. He needs help. He's sick. That's lame. Hmm. It's almost as if she wants him to get sick and die. So that she can become queen. How very peculiar. Alright, so this is an inn. I'm going to go ahead and save really quick. Uh, save over to this one. Yes, yeah, that's where I was practicing. I was near the Mushroom Kingdom practicing the super jump. It was pretty neat. Alright, um, are there any, like, hidden, yeah, there's quite a few more hidden chests in this Nimbus Land place. Alright, but I'm gonna go ahead and head down here, and, um, wait, oh, I have to, you talk to this guy, don't I? Let me see. Welcome, come on in, so you want to rest, I'm sure, okay, it'll be 30 coins a night. Um, ah, yeah, sure. Let me guess, you want to use the Dream Cushion, right? That'll be 30 more coins. Okay, so this is going to cost 60 coins every time, but when you tr when you do this, you're going to get a special dream. And some of them can be really weird, and most of them are pointless, except for like a funny little cutscene. But one of them in particular, um, I'll show it when it happens. Actually, I'll probably show all of them, just to show them, because it's kind of awesome. And um, one of them, you will get a good item after it, so I'm going to keep trying this until I run out of coins, or I get that special item. So just... Hold on. And if I do run out of coins, I'll probably just reset, so... Yeah. Alright, so, let's do this. Okay, what's this one? Yeah, yeah! Mario, 
I've kept this secret until now, but I'm really a, 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 holy shit, a monster, oh my god, wait, what, that's the dream, that's the, that's the first dream right there, and it's the one that gets you this special item, um, yeah, because Toad appears here, and Mario's like, what, what, oh my god, no, Toad, don't scare me, oh my god, oh my god, you're a monster, T Toad, just go away, are you all right, dude, you're a freaking monster, get away, we're kicking up a sweat. Here, drink this and blow the bad guys away. And you get a red essence for that. I guess we'll dump something for that. What can we dump here? We already have four red essences. Are you kidding me? That's crazy. Um. Oh, this stuff. I guess we can dump the crystal out. I'll probably never use that. I guess this is a goodbye. Oh my god. That, I actually got that dream on my first freaking try. Oh my goodness. I, like, last time I did that, which is only, like, one other time I think I've ever done this, it took me, like, an hour to get that dream. Like, I'm not kidding, and I had to reset quite a few times, because I ran out of coins. It was crazy. I just got that on the first freaking try. My goodness. I swear. Sometimes, like, I get extremely unlucky, and the LP or curse just comes into play. But when I'm doing things like this, where you're supposed to have to, like, try a lot, like, mini games and luck-dependent things, I get lucky as hell in my LPs. This is a crazy... I might show those dreams some other time, like the rest of the dreams, but for now I'm just going to stick with that and going to move on here. Move on with Nimbus Land. Um, alright. And this is actually getting close to, like, the final area of the game, if you can believe it or not. I think there's only a few more areas left. Which is cool, but it's also kind of sad. I'm going to be sad to see this LP go. Ah, did never used to have guards? Hmm. Seems that this Valentina person is kind of trying to take over this place. Where's this go? Nowhere? And it's probably going to be important later. I mean, why would they just have an area that doesn't do anything, right? Or right, Garrow's ha house. What's this about? I'm the sculptor Garrow. I used to make a lot of statues of King Nimbus, but now, all I get are orders for sculptures of Valentina. That sucks. Wait, what the hell is this? Huh? It's Mallow and Gold. Hey, look, it's me! Oh, you mean that? That's, a, that's, a young, that's King Nimbus when he was a young lad. Huh? What the? Who are you? Hello, my name is Mallow. And this is my friend Mario. It's me, a Mario. Mallow? So it is you, my boy. It's been so long. My, you've become a splendid young prince. What? Yeah, I like that was a plot twist at all. What? I'm, I'm really a prince? Oh my god. Who, whoever saw... Oh. Um, I guess he's retelling the story of what Frog Fuchsia's told us about his parents and stuff. Or something like that. You are not really a tadpole, Mallow. Right. Yes, indeed, I understand. So you were raised by Frog Fuchsia's. There is no question about it. You are, without a doubt, Prince Mallow. Mario, look at me. I'm a prince. I'm a prince. I'm a prince. That makes me a sort of five prince. I knew Valentina was up to something. I just didn't know what. That must mean, that might, oh, by the way, that thing I was doing just a second ago, that was a failed Spaceballs reference. Then let's go inside that castle and save my mother and father. Oh, man, I was pissed off, going fist flying, crazy. Hey, who are you? You can't just barge in here. <laughs> oh, Mallow, you dumbass. You're too small to do that alone, Mallow. Crazy, you need Mario. Wait, I have an excellent idea. Come on over here. Hmm. Um... Well, we're going to come over there in the next episode of Super Mario RPG. For now, I need to do some homework and then go to bed. So, thank you everyone for watching, and until next time, this is Argon Matrix signing out. Uh, thank you, and good night.